live with multiple sclerosis. I was going to say I suffer from, but I prefer I live with multiple sclerosis. As my MS started getting worse over the years, I had to come to the decision to sell that home and find a home with absolutely no steps. And that was difficult, finding a ground floor unit with no steps. And I finally found it in Reston back in 2001. And when coming to Reston, before then, I started using this facility, the community center, back in 92. So this is 20 years that I've been using this facility, which to me is my second home. I come here every other day to swim because it's important for my multiple sclerosis to keep exercising. And I love to be in the water, so that helps. Or you don't get to choose your diseases. You don't get to choose your challenges. So whatever challenge you're confronted with, you gotta be brave. There are many times when you're really scared, but you gotta be brave and say, okay, how am I gonna handle this? You gotta talk to as many people as possible. Many people don't like to talk about their diseases and everybody's different. Me, I like to talk a lot. So by talking and reaching out to people, people now in turn want to help you. If people don't know what your needs are or if you want help, they're not going to help you. People tend to keep their distance. That's my experience. You know, they look at you, they'll say hello, but they tend to keep their distance. But once you are friendly with people and let them know what your needs are, they want to help you. I rely totally on the bus. All different bus systems that operate. So I'm not in control. Yeah, spontaneity is over for me. I can't just pick up and jump in my car and go where I want to go. It, the bus must be booked in advance. You know, seven days in advance, you know, one day in advance, you have to do it in advance. The ADA law requires that buildings have accessible entrance ways, accessible bathrooms, and so on, and many places don't. So I am happy to see the evolution of it in this building. But there are other public places that you go to. Um, the Reston Hospital, I'm at the hospital all the time. If you want to use the bathrooms in the hospital, right there at a modern hospital, you have to wait for somebody to open the door for you. I've lived in many communities in my life, not just in the U.S., other places. And I find Reston to be the best community in the true sense of the word community that I've experienced in all my life. People reach out to you, people are caring, and people, you know, they want to help. But they can't help unless you tell them that you need help.